Welcome to this week's Assembly Boys and Girls, another great week. And one of the things that's made me most proudest this week has been the way that you have been caring, not just for people in the school, but out with the school. And we're gonna show you some pictures and some videos of the way that people have been caring for our community, the caring for their family and everybody else. Well done. Gran and Granda and they were just really happy to see us after a wee while because they haven't really seen them since uh, the lockdown again and uh, they were just really happy again to see us and just hear from us and I think it really just made it happy. Happy to hear from you. Yeah. Yeah, well done. Well done, boys and girls, for all of your kind work this week. It has been immense, and we are exceptionally proud of you. You are doing everything we are looking for you to do by shining for some common kills. So, well done. Right, so this cheeky reading ninja that I have heard about has been all over the place and we're going to have a wee look in a minute to see what he's been up to. And also we're going to see some of the wonderful reading that you have been getting up to at home. Well done to all of those boys and girls who have been reading and the Reading Ninja has posted your picture on Twitter. Great. Okay, last week we had our movie trailer which we released last Friday and on Wednesday this week we released our movies. And whenever a movie is released one of the most important things that happens straight afterwards is they get a review. I wonder, are there reviews in? <laughs> the videos were amazing, all the boys and girls did a really great job and it looked so much fun. I really enjoyed it. Um, maybe we want to try, because especially we've been Danny's last year. 
but well done, full skill. It was brilliant. Did you enjoy it? Yeah, sent it to the grandparents as well in Portugal. Brilliant. Thank One. Oh, yes. So we watched the Christmas um, kids do their thing yesterday and it was absolutely brilliant. Everyone was having a great time and we must say we loved it. Merry Christmas to everyone. What did you think of them? They were really, really good. Did you enjoy it? Yeah, they were brilliant. Yep. Mira's, um, yeah, Mira loved it. Brilliant. It's a really good video, so it was. Brilliant. Uh, fantastic performance by all the kids in the uh, uh, rooms 5 and 11. Uh, magnificent work by the teachers and the pupils. Um, 5 out of 5. One. Absolutely loved the Christmas shows on YouTube. Both boys did absolutely fantastic and absolutely brilliant for the school. Yes, well I thought the Christmas videos were excellent. Yeah, really good and very enjoyable. Yeah. The kids were absolutely amazing in the Christmas videos. So much fun. They were great. One. Okay, the Christmas video from yesterday was amazing. Woo! It's great to see all the kids and actually having so much fun that we usually get to see face to face. And I think you appreciate it too. So thank you so much. Yes, well done, kids. That was great. It surely spread some Christmas cheer. All the mums and dads love seeing it. One. I thought it was magic. My boys in primary one, so it was primary one's one we watched. I thought it was really good considering the situation he's around anyway. He's done great. Oh, it was really, really good. And Merry Christmas. Yes, thank you. Morning, well done, children. We loved your video, didn't we? Merry Christmas. Hi guys. The Christmas video was amazing. We watched them and all the classes did a fantastic job. Yeah. You can see how much effort went in to learning your parts and well done kiddos. Now this week's Twitter highlights. what's happening in the world with our weekly news. School news. Well done to all the boys and girls for their Christmas shows which have been a huge success on YouTube. This week has been really busy with the Christmas parties. Don't forget that next Monday is the Christmas Monday. US comedy star Tina Fey recently explained how she saved a man's life. Speaking to Jimmy Fallon on this night show, she said that when she was in New York, she heard a man screaming. Then she realised it was a man drowning in the Hudson River. She quickly pulled, pulled him out and said, saved his life. The French president has recently tested positive for COVID-19. He says he claims that he's getting better and feels okay, but it's still unreal. Scottish news. Nicola Sturgeon is you might call sick and walk down soon, but she's keeping schools open, so no self-isolating for you. Lost Egyptian artifacts have been found in a cigar box. M most of them are worth over a thousand pounds and could be put in new museums. Christmas news. English gangs are going, are going to trucks that are holding the PS5 and stealing them. It's very scary, but I'm sure we'll find them soon. And the Nintendo are bringing back the old NES console for Christmas. It's an exclusive and only a hundred are selling.
think shame certificate winners are. Very, very proud of you. Now we're going to pass you on to Father Bernard. Good afternoon, boys and girls. I'm delighted to join you for one final time before your Christmas holidays. I join you, of course, here in our parish church, St Colum Kills. And as you can see behind me, I'm standing here at our crib. As you can see, we're waiting on someone to be added to the nativity scene. Of course, Jesus himself that comes to us at Christmas time. On Christmas morning, I'm sure that you will receive many gifts, many presents from your friends and family, and of course, from Santa Claus. But the greatest gift that we can be given is Jesus, of course, himself. I invite you to come here with your family over the days of the Christmas holidays. The church will be open um, for mass twice a day, and all of the times, of course, at the weekend. At the weekend, you have to book. But during the week, you can come along with your, with your family, and I invite you to come here to pay a visit to our little manger scene, to ask the baby Jesus to come into your heart, and you can be like him in all things. Christmas isn't Christmas till it happens in your heart. Somewhere deep inside you is where Christmas really starts. So give your heart to Jesus, you'll discover when you do, that it's Christmas, really Christmas for you. A very happy Christmas to you all, to your friends and family, and I wish you every blessing for the coming year. Thank you very much, Father Bernard. So that just leaves me, boys and girls, to wrap up and say have a lovely weekend. Now remember, Monday is your Christmas lunch and Christmas fun day, so make sure you're wearing your Christmas jumpers to school. And also, since Mr Gray's not here, I'm going to say no uniform on Tuesday, okay? Yeah, it's very quick, do it before Mr. Gray comes. Go enjoy the weekend.